two helpers today, Archie and Matilda, and we're going to make Anzac biscuits. So first off, we're going to go through what you need to make the Anzac biscuits. You'll need a large bowl and a wooden spoon, a small saucepan, and two baking trays. And then for the ingredients, you're going to need one and a quarter cups of plain, plain sugar, plain flour. You're going to need one cup of rolled oats. Rolled oats. You're going to need um, half a cup of caster sugar. sugar. Three quarters of a cup of desiccated coconut. 150 grams of chopped butter. You'll need uh, two tablespoons of golden syrup uh, and then you'll also need one and a half tablespoons of water and half a teaspoon of baking soda so the first thing we're going to do is get our big bowl and then we're going to put our dry ingredients into the bowl minus our baking soda and you have soda. to get your wooden spoon yeah so we've got our plain flour do you want to pour that into the bowl Plain flour straight into the bowl. Pepper. Archie, you want to do the rolled oats? And then we've got our. Do you remember what that is? No. Caster sugar. Straight into the bowl. What's this one? Desiccated. or on the heat. Now we're going to do half a teaspoon uh, of baking. baking soda into our water. So half a teaspoon. Do you know how much half a teaspoon is? That's half of this whole spoon. Okay, that's about half a teaspoon. Can you give that a stir for me? Yeah. We're going to give it a stir now. Okay, put it up there and give it a little stir. Now our butter and golden syrup is melted. We're going to add our water and baking soda mixture and this is going to bubble up. Give it a little stir arch. Is that cool? Mm -hmm. Now 
now we've got our bubbly mixture. We're going to be careful because it's hot and we're going to pour it into our uh, dry ingredients. And it smells good. just making one tray um, but they're baked about 10 minutes and cooled down a little bit now they're ready to eat yummy mm, you try one Yeah, I 